So for our latest video, we are going to be doing some aerobics and fitness. Okay, so we're going to have a little warm up to start with. I'm using similar sort of areas in our, some of our previous videos. However, we will be spending a lot more time on the spot. So don't worry if you haven't got quite such a big space as these codes laid out are. Don't worry too much because we're not using all of it or not using a huge amount of it in these videos. So, for our warm up, we're going to have a quick game of beans. Now, those of you who played beans before, you have a bit of an idea what's involved. However, I will quickly explain. Now, I'm going to shout out different types of beans, and each bean is a different movement, okay? So, run a bean, quite simple, jogging on the spot. If I shout run a bean, if I shout jumping bean, jump on the spot, keeping your knees together, landing on the two feet. If I shout broad bean, arms and legs out to the side, in a star shape. Stringy bean, knees together, feet together, stretching up to the sky. If I shout jelly bean, we're going to shake our arms and legs, make sure we're nice and loose. Okay. If I shout baked bean, now if you're outside guys, I want you to go into a ball and wrap your arms around your knees. If you're inside, you can go on the knees into a more of a ball like that. It's not a problem. If I shout beans on toast, okay, again, if you're outside, beans on toast, I want you to go into your T shape and try and balance on one foot. If you're outside, you can have a go at that, or you can lie on your back and spread your arms up like that, okay? So, that's quite a lot of different things to remember. I'm going to call them out, so if you do forget, just copy me, alright? We're going to do this for about one, one and a half minutes, two minutes, okay? So to warm ourselves up, to stretch our body out, to make sure we're ready for our fitness aerobics. Okay, give you a few seconds to get ready. Are we ready? Three, two, one, go. Jumping B, jump, jump, jump. Keep those legs together, land it on the two feet. Run a bee. Jogging on the spot. Our aim for our warm up is to always be moving in our fitness and aerobics. Always to be moving, even if we stop and stretching, we're still moving, we're still helping our body. Stringy bee. Touch up to the sky. Make sure you're stretching it. You should feel it in your arms. Broad bee. Out to the sides, you're stretching wide now. Again, you feel it in your arms and your legs. Jelly bean, we're going to shake your arms and legs off. Shake, shake, shake. Make sure you shake your arms and your legs. Run a bean. Back to running. Good guys, keep it up. Keep it up. Big bean, into your ball. Beans on toast. We are T pose or flat on our back, whichever one you choose. Run a bean. Oh, yeah, that's my bean. Jumping bean. I'm going to go a little bit quicker now for the last few ones. Stringy bean. Run a bean. Jelly bean. Last 30 seconds. Shake, 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 shake. Bake bean. Jumping bean. Broad bean. And relax, guys. What I'd like you to do, just shake off your arms and legs. Jelly bean to finish off. So we're nice and loose, ready for our aerobics activities. Good work, guys. Well done. Okay guys, for our first activity in our fitness and aerobics, we are going to be pirates. Okay, now our pirates have lots of jobs and I'm the captain today and your job is to keep the pirate ship nice and clean and tidy. So I've got a few jobs for you guys, so you're ready to embark on our day as a pirate. 
Now our first one is scrubbing the deck to make sure the deck is nice and clean and tidy. So when we scrub the deck, we're going to bend our knees, hands out in front of us, and we're going to move our hips and our arms side to side as if we're scrubbing the deck. Okay? Make sure you bend your knees, otherwise you'll start to get an achy back after about 20, 20 seconds or so. So it's really important to bend our knees, arms out in front, and we're moving from side to side. Okay? Let's scrub the deck, number one. Climb the rigging is our number two. And we've got to climb up to the top of the rigging so that it's all safe up there and we're able to set sail. So, climbing the rigging, I want you to get your knees really high. And we're going to climb as if we're climbing up an invisible ladder. So, climbing up the rigging, arms and legs moving. Make sure our knees are getting really high. So try and get your knees as high as you can, climbing up to the top of the rigging, okay? Now our third job that we have to do, it's very important this one, we have to make sure our cannons are working in case there are some enemy pirate ships around. So, firing the cannon, you're going to stand in your area, move your two feet together, and you're going to use your arms, bend your knees, and you're going to jump from two feet onto two feet. You can then jump again, you can either turn around or maybe go to the side, Bend your knees, arms out in front, swing and jump. Okay? We're going to do each activity for 30 seconds. Okay? We're going to do them in order. Alright? Are we ready, guys? Our first one is scrub deck. Get yourselves ready. We're going to start in a few seconds. Three, two, one, go. Bend your knees and now we're scrubbing the deck. Scrub deck, move from side to side. Moving those arms, bending those knees. Scrub, scrub, scrub. Keep going, guys. Another 15 seconds. Moving from side to side. Try and keep going for the full 30. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, now, climbing the rigging. Are we ready, guys? Three, two, one, go! We're climbing up to the top of the rigging. Get those knees really high. It's very high up here, we've got to go really fast. Climb up to the top. We're almost there, guys. 10 more seconds. Keep going. Good stuff, three, two, one. One, okay, straight into fire the cannon. Bend your knees, ready, and jump. Bend your knees, and jump. Bend your knees, use your arms, and jump. Bend your knees, jump. You'll start to feel it on your legs. Another 10 seconds. space that you've got and, and try and do as best you can, alright? You, you'll still be able to work out regardless of how big your space is. So, I've got four cones in the corners of my space, alright? And each cone is going to be given a number and we're going to move in different ways for 30 seconds each around to these cones. Now, number one is the top left, so as you're looking at me, alright, number one is the one in front of you. Okay, to the side. Number two, the other side, all right. Number three is back to the left. Okay, that's number three. And number four is back to the right, okay. Now I'm gonna call out numbers. What I'd like you to do is the movement that we're doing, 
go to that cone, that back cone, that number of cone. Once you've gone to that cone, so if I say two, and you go to two, you're going to go around two, and then you're going to come back to the middle cone. So if you've got a middle cone or a drinks bottle, a shoe that you're using at home, whatever you're using to mark out your area, you've got to go back to that middle spot or cone before you can move to your next number. Okay? Are we ready, guys? So our three movements are going to be running round the cone and back to the middle. Our second movement is jumping, jump around the cone, back to the middle. And our third movement is hopping, okay? You can choose which leg you want to hop on. Try and keep your balance as much as you can. Hopping around the cone and back to the middle, okay? We're going to do each movement for 30 seconds. We're going to start with running. Are we ready, guys? Just to recap, one, two, three, four. Okay, three, two, one, go. Two, go round two, back to the middle, four, round four, back to the middle, one, round one, back to the middle, trying to keep going half time, three, two, three, and there it is. Back to the middle, two. Back to the middle, one. Back to the middle, last five, oh, three, oh, three. Oh, wait, 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 three, six, four. And back to the middle, and stop. I think it went a bit wrong now, yeah? went to the wrong one. But good stuff, guys, well done. Second movement is jumping. So two feet together two feet. Are we ready? Hopefully I won't go wrong this time. Three, two, one, go. Three. Three, six, one. Got it right this time. Ready? One. Keep those feet together. Let's make it moving. Two. Good stuff guys, well done. Okay guys, to finish off our third activity, we're going to have a game of traffic lights. Now you guys are in your cars, okay? And we're going to do some, a few different movements in our cars, alright? When I call out different colours, okay? And we've got four different colours that we're going to use today. Now the red is stop. Okay, so if I shout red, you're going to stop where you are and you're going to balance on one foot for about five seconds. You can put your arms out to the side if you want to, okay, just to keep your balance. However you feel you can balance, you can use your left foot or your right foot, whichever you feel more comfortable with. So that's red. Amber or orange, okay, is jumping. 
So if I shout amber or orange, we're going to jump around that space that you've got. Now remember, if it's smaller, bigger, don't worry. Whichever, however big your space is, try your best to keep moving around as much as possible. So we're going to jump around our area. Jump, jump, jump. That's orange. Green is run. Now obviously, if your space is slightly smaller, you're not going to be able to run quite as fast. But running, I want you to run around to the different corners of our area. So if you've got your bottles, whatever you've got to mark your area, run around inside the zone in whichever way you'd like. Okay? Our fourth colour is blue. Now blue, obviously not a traffic light, however it is change direction, because cars, they change direction. Alright? So if we're running, as we're on green, and I just have to change direction, we've got to go the other way and run in the other direction. If we're jumping, just in this way, we've got to jump in a different direction. We've got to change whichever way we're going. Okay? So just to recap, red is stop, amber is jump, okay? Green is run. And blue or change direction is obviously changing the direction that we're going. Okay? Are we ready? We're going to do this for about a minute. Alright? Are we ready? Start in the middle. Three, two, one, go. Green, off we go. Off we go, we're going around. You can pretend that we're on a racetrack. You might be on a racetrack. Off we go. Zipping around the racetrack. Orange! You want to jump, jump. Jump around and swear. Jump, jump, jump. Keep those legs together. Red! You can balance really still. I can do that well that time. Balance really still on one leg. Green! Off we go. You move around in the space. Try and go as fast as you can. Try and keep moving. Change direction, we're going the other way. Back level square in the other direction. Change direction again. Go the other way again. Keep going, guys, keep going. Last five seconds. And stop. Okay, good stuff. Now, good stuff, guys. Now, you can add things to that if you'd like to. You might add hopping. You might add that you can go around the cone, like a roundabout, okay? Different ways that you can move in your area. Let's see who can be really fast, really high top speed in your car. Good stuff, guys. Well done.